Good morning, everyone. It's um, July 13th, and I had something weighing on my mind for a long time, so finally made up my mind on what I'm going to do. It's kind of a big decision, but anyway, I think it's time to cut that big yellow thing and see what it is. So let's go take a look at it. First of all, why did I decide to cut it today? Well, I have to decide if it's a summer squash or a winter squash. And from the looks of it, it almost looks like a, a yellow squash. Because now it's almost looking like a yellow pumpkin. Maybe I'll change my mind. We'll see. Um, the second reason that I decided maybe I should cut it is because... I have more growing. So if I do mess it up, I'll have backup and more will grow. So let me take a closer look at it just to make sure this is really what I want to do. But if that's a yellow pumpkin, it's probably the coolest thing ever. And I should let it go. So there it is. It got pretty big. You know, it even sounds like it needs to be harvested. Okay, let's do it. Let's just cut it off. No more will grow. Of course, I don't think this is big enough to cut it off. turning back now I cannot it feels like it's going to be a summer squash so <sighs> kind of heavy though I'm surprised they're still green on the other side so anyway let me take this inside and cut it up and see what we got cut this thing open. Let's see what's inside. It actually is green on one side which was down low so I don't know about that but anyway top part was done. Let's see what this inside looks like. It cuts very easy. Very, very thick rind. Let's see on the inside. Let's see if I can. Zucchini seeds. I don't know what this is. Um, smells like a pumpkin, but completely white flesh. So I guess I'll cook some of this up and see what it tastes like. And I will show you that when I get there. Okay, so here's the finished product. Um, I actually ate this a couple days ago, just getting around to filming it now. It was pretty much flavorless. All I did is I put olive oil and some salt on it and baked it, and it was pretty much flavorless. So, I mean, very edible. I would eat it again, um, especially if you spice it up just right. I would say the 
consistency was almost that of spaghetti squash. Now let's see up there where it's looking a little like spaghetti squash. Um, but anyway, um, I would say this is probably more of a summer squash than a winter squash. But really won't know for sure until I let the other ones ripen. So anyway, that is my mystery yellow squash and what I did with it. Um, hope you liked it and thanks for watching.